What's up, guys? Today I want to talk about a film called Long Legs. The film was written and directed by Oz Perkins. It stars Micah Monroe, Blair Underwood, and Nicolas Cage as the titular character, Long Legs. I know there was a lot of hype about this movie, a lot of stuff online calling this movie the most frightening film uh, in recent times, and people were uh, really psyched to see it. I know it did really well over the weekend. I went into this film knowing very little about it. I wasn't uh, aware of all the hype. I just went in expecting a kind of crime thriller in the spirit of Silence of the Lambs or Seven, a creepy crime thriller, if you will. I got a lot more than I was expecting in terms of what the film actually is. And I'm gonna get into spoilers here. The film takes a supernatural twist it's about two thirds of the way through. And I was surprised by the twist. I was also a little disappointed, if I'm being honest. The supernatural element of the film felt a little easy to me as an explanation for this bizarre set of serial killings that's been plaguing the FBI. Micah Monroe plays the lead character who's on a quest to investigate and hopefully capture the killer who's leaving notes uh, at the homes of all the murder sites. And there's a lot of mystery in terms of how the murderer is getting in and out of these houses. Is he the actual murderer or is he causing someone in the family to go on this horrible killing sprees that the FBI is uncovering along the course of the film? By and large, the film feels sort of run of the mill in terms of uh, an investigative procedural. It's not that scary. It's not super creepy. The one thing that is super creepy is Nicolas Cage as long legs. And it's not just one note, Nick Cage bouncing off the wall. There are actually layers to the crazy as you get a sense that there's an individual trapped inside this possessed body, almost childlike, screaming for help, screaming for his mommy and his daddy. It's really quite disturbing, but at the same time, you can't take your eyes off it. Beyond that, the film is well-directed. There are stylistic flourishes that I appreciated. All the performances are really strong. I especially enjoyed Blair Underwood, who brings a very soothing presence to the film so that it's even more heartbreaking when he meets his tragic fate at the end of the day. So those are my thoughts on Long Legs. If you like this review and you want to see more, click like and subscribe, and I will see you next time.